future work camps, actually this summer's work camps, uh, funded by Vichyvet Fund uh, within the project Learn, Volunteer and Share. My name is Linka, I'm from Czech Republic and I'm 19 years old and this summer I'm going to lead my first summer work camp. It will be a work camp where the participation will run new uh, old building uh, where uh, we want to host EBS volunteers from Spain. During LTS, we had 18 young people as participants from different countries, such as uh, Slovakia, Czech Republic, Poland, uh, Hungary, as Visegrad countries. And then we have cooperation with the Western Balkan countries, such as Albania, um, Serbia, uh, Bosnia, <laughs> Macedonia. And Within this project, there are uh, 10 organizations who will organize 10 work camps and uh, well, almost all of them are quite different. So we have uh, from camps from Albania that deal with uh, young uh, people with disabilities all the way to Hungary who, who deal with restoration or a castle and uh, all the way to Poland and Bosnia who deal with environmental protection. But uh, we decided on this training course to provide uh, the participants with basic skills and general skills of uh, work camps so that they can apply them on uh, every work camp and no matter the topic. I think that it was uh, very useful for me, example. I found out uh, that uh, being a leader is much more difficult than I thought at the first time. Uh, if you compare the participants who are attending this training, you can see the huge difference between uh, uh, their ideas and thoughts at the, on the first day of the training and, uh, and today. I finished a uh, training course in Sremski Karlovci. Uh, it was three months ago and I'm trying to use my knowledge that I get there. Our seventh youth summer camp we started in 2007. Uh, not in this location but uh, remote from Vlasinca also in the mountains with a with a vision that uh, 15 young people can change something in their lives organizing camps. Uh, this is my first camp. Uh, so far, I like it. I'm 16 years old, uh, and this is my uh, eighth camp, second time in Vlasinica. This is one of the four camps that uh, this year are organized in Bosnia and Herzegovina through the project Learn Volunteer Share. I re I'm really happy because I'm here in Vlasinica to hold the training for the young people here. Um, I, I trained them on uh, two topics, European citizenship and volunteering. Here, we are here today at one of the actions of the International Art Camp in Kosjeric, which has been going on for 12 years now, and uh, uh, to bring them together for, for two weeks during the summer, to work in four, four workshops in different forms of art. Uh, there is a sounding workshop where musicians uh, from everywhere come to uh, create, compose new music. There is a street, uh, street galleries workshop is dedicated to graffiti art and street art. Also different illustrators, artists come and try their skill on, on this workshop. Uh, there is a theater or a physical theater workshop. To, to learn that there was a children workshop as well, actually animated by one leader and the kids. Um, and because uh, they, the leaders, they knew that they, get to, they got to know that I was a, uh, a clown and uh, they were interested that I interact with the, the children. And actually it was uh, pretty nice. Uh, my name is Sandro. I come from Italy, uh, well, I live in Spain, and it is my first uh, camp. We are trying to do uh, several installations uh, regarding risk. It's our, our theme, 
our guide. So I just found this tab and I would like to just uh, show some kind of a risk if you would like to have a shower or something like this. So I'm just putting these nails everywhere around the tub and in the end I would like to uh, put them a lot of water inside. We started from this, like we have these characters that uh, we've been doing together with Anais, like Komsa, <laughs> and yeah, this was the starting point. So we wanted to make a big character on the wall. It's really interesting to work in this group. Uh, well, it's smaller because I was there last year and we were a bigger group and more like from all around the world. So this one is a bit more European. Yeah, we came here yesterday and uh, we basically have uh, just about 24 hours to do everything. The wall has been uh, scraped off, we scraped all the paint off and painted it white just in a matter of, I don't know, five hours. And this happened in, I don't know, two hours. So, uh, yeah, you can see that uh, when you put 20 people together and work on something, it's really fast and you can make a lot in just in, just in one day. And then um, Sanya, she's a work camp leader for uh, street galleries, came up with this idea of doing a time lapse of their work because they will be like painting this wall into like two, three, four days. So we thought, oh, it actually would be really cool to make sort of kind of a animation movies uh, that would be showing like the evolution of their work from beginning to end. I really like the idea of um, collaborating and mixing the, the workshops, you know, for example, we, we picked uh, the theater gr group to work with because theater and music, you know, this is the most happily marriage. <laughs> Usually I play uh, mostly guitar and uh, keyboard at home and try to make some pop songs or something, and, but here you can uh, uh, evolve also like playing with the other people and really composing a lot of different stuff. And, one of the songs we are performing is uh, my song, which I wrote a few years ago, I think, and uh, it's quite different from what I usually play and do. Uh, but it's funny, sarcastic, though it's about love. Uh, yeah, I came here last year because I was recommended by a friend who'd come here a couple of years ago. And so I didn't know anything about Serbia or anything, you know. But it was a big surprise and I absolutely loved it. And so I had to come back again this year. Our participants keep coming back whether as visitors, whether as participants again, but uh, it's the kind of atmosphere that actually creates friends.